Hi guys, uh, welcome back to the channel and welcome to this part three of um, Airfix 172 scale Bristol Beaufort uh, Mark 1. The final reveal. Yay! Um, and just on a side note, I'll be in Telford on Saturday and Sunday. Come and say hello. Let's get jump into it, get over to the desk and see what we've done. Thanks. So guys, here we are at the uh, at the hobby desk, and here we are. This is um, well, I think it's complete. Um, this is the we uh, we Bristol Beaufort finished. Um, uh, overall, a, a great wee build, I must say. I really enjoyed it. I made a complete Henry's of the paint job, but never mind, eh? Um, but I really enjoyed the enjoyed the build. Um, a few wee issues. Um, as he tries not to break something as he picks it up so um i just taken off the the canopy masks there and it turned out okay i made the mask myself um it turned okay um could have been better i suppose um actually i i i, I masked the back of this turret here and didn't realize that you, you don't see it so i had a bit of an issue there the last hour trying to get, get the masks out from one behind it but um it, it's all good not too bad uh, decals went down super duper uh, I just put down the basic ones I was worried about this and the instructions it shows you to do this here you know this overlapping but I, I, I looked up a bit of uh, photos not like me of course doing a bit of research and it seems to be the, the case on um, on the the actual actual aircraft um, so really enjoyed the build as I say uh, we we have uh, we have we've lost a couple of men here these wee glass things I just put these on last night they're so tiny i think they've just popped off ah uh, sure can't be perfect eh but i didn't put the pilot in um but um a bit of a gap here uh that's probably just me bad fitting maybe i should have I, I did test fit it and it looked okay but um hey ho what to do um and i think we've lost a, a soldier around here oh no the glass is still there it's just come away a wee bit when I was taken off, you know that liquid mass, but I think I uh, was a wee bit aggressive. Um, another thing was, I don't know, Arfisk, if you're listening, but I don't know how many times I've tried to glue this on to this piece here. See, that goes on like that. Um, I, I maybe should try super glue, but uh, it just kept coming off. Maybe it needs to be molded in one, one section and it just sits, slips onto that, but um, that's that's a real difficult. difficult. Uh, I lost one of these guys too, they just bounced off, don't know where they went to. I, I have a tile floor here where I work and I just can't find it. Um, main issues I had with it was um, the uh, curling uh, for the engines, um, weren't a great fit, a uh, bit of filling, sanding and also the, um, the landing gear doors, that's a tough fit, so it is a real tough fit. Um, very tight there um, but other than that um, you know pretty pretty happy with the turnout try to do a bit of weathering of smoke exhaust from the from the from the engines um, over and over and under the wing um, but um, yeah all good um, as I said in one of the previous videos uh, I think the the, the paint call out that that Humbrol Nerfix give you for the the green I think it was was um it was um just i thought it was wrong but i'm no expert but um i'd love to hear you you you, you guy comments uh your guy comments anyway um uh my big thing here was it was a, an exercise in hand painting with uh, the airbrush freehand and um, obviously that that looks okay it looks quite solid lines but i, I tidied that up with a brush um, because I was getting, I wasn't getting a, a, a firm line, a strong straight line or a st strong edge, should I say rather. Um, but you know, uh, practice makes perfect, and uh, we'll we'll keep going at it. But um, I'd really recommend this this wee build for anybody who's interested in this. In fact, I might do the is it the Bristol Blemming? I think there's another one in this these these here guys, uh, another uh, wee mid range bomber. So I'll have a go at that as well. But um, 
Um, there you are, lads uh, and girls. Uh, I thought I would give you a wee, a wee final reveal uh, on the on the Bristol brand. As I say in the introduction, um, heading to Tilford this uh, this weekend. Uh, I'm flying from Saudi on Friday, uh, and then catching our plane Saturday morning, and um, I'll get over. Really excited to, to, to be there to see it. Um, it uh, I just hear great reviews about it. But um, uh, there you are, guys. Thanks for watching. Any comments, good or bad, please please stick them down and let me know. I'll I'll try and get back to everybody. Uh, and until the next time, uh, if I don't see you in Telford, I'll see you soon. Take care. Happy modeling. Cheers. Thanks. Bye.